Figured I'd show this video off really quickly. This is another quick video, just throwing out a couple quick ones just to throw the ideas out there. I got this idea, or at least this tip, from No Respawn. You can see his channel, No Respawns. I have it in. I'll go ahead and put a link to his channel in the, in the description. I've done it before. And he's got a tutorial on how to get these have concrete floors and concrete ceilings with concrete walls all around. This building was by far the easiest in Sanctuary Hills. You can pretty much throw almost anything in this house for some reason and it's green all the way through. Don't understand why this house is so much different than all the others here. I was just trying to show off the dirt before, but I had it low enough that it wasn't actually showing up. But I'll just go into a couple of these houses just to show where I put the walls and the ceilings and the floors. It's all built in one piece and then glitched over using concrete floor slab, you know, that big concrete block that goes into the, the ground. I'm trying to come up with, utilize the buildings on, or the houses on how they're supposed to be, or how they would have been done. I've already done the Vault 81 stuff, so that's, uh, Tina DeLuca there, I got her to come back to the settlement. Here you'll see the, the floor pieces from the concrete set. I threw a fire <laughs> inside the, the furnace there. I actually like how this turns out because obviously it protects the ceiling from you know all the holes and if you do it right you can get the floors to show it kind of looks like a little tile system. There's more sand, you'll see pounding on that, and it's so stupid because, I don't know, the NPCs just don't seem to recognize that concrete is actually there. I've noticed it in a lot of other settings where they'll try and walk a certain path, and if the concrete is there, they'll just sit there and bump into it multiple times until they realize, oh, I gotta go around. And so sometimes the AI in this game is a little left to be desired at least from the settlers but with this new save that I'm on right now this new build one of my other mods is finally working and I can control the settlers to a certain ex extent I can they'll, they'll get random names you can control how many male or females you have and you can also control whether or not they can randomly die or if only you can kill them or if they're immortal Plus, you can also randomly assign them things. You can, it's like you can call them to your location and just give them out random things to do. I'm going to go ahead and end this video off here. Once again, thanks for watching. Bye.